What's up guys? In today's video, we'll be talking about how to install Chrome extensions on your Android device. Let's jump right in. To be able to download and install Chrome browser extensions on your Android device, you will need to download also and install the Kiwi browser. Besides being able to install Chrome browser extensions, the Kiwi browser has the following features. It has night mode, it has ad pop-up blocker. Of course, you can use the Kiwi browser to block ads just like you have ad block browser and other forms of browser-based ad blockers for Android. The address bar on the Kiwi browser is at the bottom, so we have the bottom address bar. You have an intuitive interface, which means that it is easy to use and it looks very much like Chrome. It has a customizable homepage, which means the, the page that opens once you load the app can be customized. You can determine what icons show up on that page. It has also a feature where it's able to block ads on your notification drawer. So it can block notification ads and you can also browse the internet in incognito mode just like you have on Chrome. Of course, basically, it has so many features that look like Chrome because it is based on Chromium. So basically, it is based on Chromium. That's why it looks and feels very much like Chrome. After that, Downloading and installing the Kiwi browser, tap on the three dot menu on the top right and select extensions. When you tap on extensions, it takes you to the extensions page. When you are at this extensions page, you tap on from store. That will open the Chrome Web Store, which allows you to search, download and install any Chrome extension that you want to install on your device. Now, once you get there, you can search for the extension that you want to install. Example, Phantom Wallet, if you are a type that, that is into crypto and you want to download and install the Phantom Wallet on your, on your Android device, you can use Kiwi Browser, go to the Chrome Web Store, search for Phantom Wallet, download and install. Of course, currently, the Wallet app Phantom does not have an Android app, so it would make a lot of sense if you're able to use it on your Android device. So once you get the app that you want to install, you tap on the search results to open the app page. Once you get to the app page, you can now tap on Add to Chrome. Once you tap Add to Chrome, it will bring up a context menu, then you tap OK. Once you tap OK, that particular Chrome extension has been added to your web browser. Now, to be able to access that Chrome extension which you just installed, you go back to the three dot menu on your on the top right corner of your browser screen. You scroll down to the bottom, you will see a list of uh, extensions which you have installed on your device. Then you can tap on any of them which you are interested in using at that very moment and then go ahead and do what you need to do, just like you would do on your Chrome on your desktop. Now, to remove extensions, of course, you follow the same procedure. You tap on the three dot menu on the top right, tap on extensions. It takes you to the extensions page. On each extension interface, you will see remove from Chrome or remove. Then once you tap on the remove button, then that extension is removed from your web browser. Now, it's good to note that it's not all extensions that are in the Chrome web store that will run on your Android device because there are some other criteria that the extension that some extensions might need to run only on Windows. So because of that, I cannot give you a 100% guarantee that all extensions that you find on the extension store will run on your Android device. But pick and choose, who knows, the particular extension that you want to use might be able to run on your Android device and you know, that is that. If this video was useful to you, please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.